This is something you should do to keep your enemies far, far from you. They will run away with tears. They will never come back anymore. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for stopping by. So I are doing today? I hope you are doing fine. So today, as I already see from the title, I'm going to be sharing with you this spiritual tip that when you apply it, it's going to drive away enemies forever. Like this is something that works effectively. You just have to follow up with the steps, okay? And it's going to work very well. So if you are new here for the first time, you are so welcome. In this channel, I share spiritual tips. Spiritual tips like this, okay? If you love it, subscribe. Hit the red subscribe button. Turn on the bell so you get notified whenever I upload videos like this. So this is not only for those that want to drive away their enemies. If you have anyone troubling you, spiritually, physically, that you wish to separate yourself from this person, this will work very well. If you are also married, your partner is having something with a side chick or a side man, if you apply this tip, it will work very well, just like a magic. So this is something we're going to use right now. You have to get onion, any color of onion, but mostly the red one. Next time I'm going to share with you how to use the white onion. It has spiritual benefits. Okay, that one is also very potent, but this particular one is especially for separation, for bringing good luck, for cleansing, so many. Okay, so you have to get onion, onion like this. You don't have to peel it, like, do not remove the peel. Do not peel it. Go ahead and cut it into halves. Not like this. Look at the roots. Do not cut it like this. Cut it from the top of the root, like from the head here. Just cut it like this into halves. You have to be careful. So when you cut it into half, do not separate it finally. Just leave it like this. Be sure not to open everything. If yours cut completely, you have to get another onion. Try this time. Cut it, but do not separate it. It's going to be like this. Okay? So when you have done that, the next thing you are going to do, if you know the name of your enemy, if you know the name of this person that is causing sleepless nights for you, if you know the name of this side chick, go ahead and write the name of the person in a plain sheet. Just the way I will be showing you right now. So let it be like this, a plain sheet. Okay, even if it has lines, no problem. But make sure you have not written anything on the paper. Then go ahead and write the name of the person. If you don't know the name of the person, just write, for instance, enemy, evil eyes. Just write it. But if you know the name of this person that is troubling your peace, just go ahead and write it. Okay? Evil eyes. If it's a psychic, that is troubling your marriage. Go ahead and write Saishik. But if you know the name of this Saishik better, for instance, the name of the Saishik is Angel. Okay, let's say Angel. You write Angel. Or if the person is a man, your wife is cheating on you and with some other guy, just write anything that comes to your mind to represent this person. Write it and that is all. Okay? So after that, you have to fold it. Fold it. Make it very small. You know? So that it can... Because you are going to put it into the onion. Remember not to open the onion totally. Insert it into the onion just like this. When you have done this, Go ahead and close it into like this. Then you start saying whatever you want. 
you know your heart desire, you know what you are praying for, start saying anything, your wishes. If it's your enemy, tell your enemy to leave you and never return again. If he's a side chick, a side man, troubling your marriage, or anybody at all troubling your peace, tell that person to leave and never return, to forget about you, to leave your partner, to leave anything that concerns you, that you need peace. If he's your enemy, tell that enemy that he should leave you alone and never come back and never remember you, that you want to progress. After saying it, then you have to open the onion again. Not all. You just have to be careful. If you open all, it's not going to cause any damage. It will not hurt you. It's just that it will not be effective anymore. So you have to get another onion. Okay, so just get pepper. Any color of pepper. You can use a black pepper. You can use a red pepper. Anyone. This is a red pepper. Okay. So you have to use a spoon, anything, just add a little. This is the pepper. Add a little into the, you know, into the onion. Be careful. Pepper is already in there. Yes, just make sure you add a little pepper. When you have done that, the next thing you are going to add inside is salt. Use salt, table salt, sea salt, any kind of salt. Okay, so I'm going to pour the salt into the onion. Okay, just find a way to make sure the salt gets in here, even if it's little. No problem. But make sure the salt and pepper gets in there. This is going to fight your enemies like it will not kill anybody, please. No one will die, nobody will be hurt. Only that it will make that person to forget about you. Forget about your partner. Forget about troubling you. The person will stay away from you. Then close it one more time, you know. We now have in here the paper which bears the name of this person or which bears your prayer points. We have pepper and we have salt, any kind of salt. Close it again. You know, you have closed it before. Then you start saying your wishes one more time. Say whatever thing you want again. Start praying that you want to have peace. That you don't want this person to keep on troubling your peace. That enough is enough. You don't want to be crying all the time. That your enemy should leave you. That you want to progress. Because most enemies, they are really obstacles. When you are trying to progress, they will keep on hindering you. If you are not strong spiritually, that is how they will keep on troubling you, troubling you until you will never be anything. So you just have to say whatever thing you want. And after saying it, just do not open it. So after that, you have to get a nylon. A nylon bag like this a plastic bag then insert the onion do not open it do not remove any content from it just put it into the nylon bag like this then tie it tie it very well let it be very tight When you have done so, you have to squeeze it. Squeeze it very hard. And tell the person that you don't want him or her to keep on troubling your peace. That whatever thing he plans for you or she plans for you, you return it back to sender. Or any damage the person must have done, that you destroy it right now and you return it back to that person. After doing this, then you go away and throw it away. Throw it anywhere, it can be in a dustbin, it can be in a bush, anywhere. Okay, so when you have done this, just have faith that it's going to work very well. In fact, just have faith that it's working already. 
have it in mind believe it that everything is settled your problem has been taken away from you just watch and see your enemies will be in tears they will run far far from you there will be confusion among them if there are many if it's your partner your the person that is troubling your peace the person will leave your wife and run away for good leave both of you to have peace if it's your husband that side she will never come back anymore this will just be like a magic it works just go ahead and try it everything is in your house is in your kitchen this is one of the effective spiritual tips that works very well it's not only for enemies it's also for separation whosoever that you want to separate from there are most people that when they come close to you or meet you they don't want to go they are not they are not bringing anything good instead they are bringing trouble trouble upon trouble they will blackmail you blackmail you until you don't know what to do anymore so if you want to separate yourself from this person this is one of the tips that you need to do and you see what will happen you just i believe you come and testify yeah because this is effective so just go ahead and try it try us and and come and tell me how it is this may not work for everybody okay because spiritual work is not a magic thanks so much for watching this subscribe give this video a thumbs up and share it to everyone i'll see you in my next video